Hi, first graders. Let's continue our learning today with our sight word color. So you're going to need out your Friday assignments and see if you can find the aliens. There's an alien and the astronauts who are on our sight word color for today. You're also going to need a box of crayons. So find your crayons nearby. I've got my box right here. So as we go through, this is our assignment for today. So I'm gonna to introduce to you what colors you're gonna need with the words that you're going to find. But I'm not gonna color the whole thing with you today. Today, I want you to have that challenge. So we're gonna go through the directions and we're gonna find the colors we need and then you'll get to do the coloring on your own today. On the back of this activity, we also have all of the words that are on the front of the site word color that we will use in sentences. So we're gonna need both of these pages today, the front with the coloring, and then again, the back with our sentences. We'll get started on this together and then you'll do some of this activity on your own as well today. So let's go ahead and turn to the coloring page, having your crayons ready. I'm gonna share my screen so that we can take a look to see what colors we need for the different words that we're going to color today. All right, on our sight word color, we first need the color white. Now the paper is white, but I do also have a white crayon here. So I'm gonna go ahead and show that my is going to be colored white. The word my, anytime I see my, I can color it white. So for example, here on his helmet and here on her helmet, we'll color those boxes white. The next word I see is called and this word will color brown. Anywhere you see the word called, like on his skin, you'll color it brown. Next, we need purple. Let me find that in my box of crayons. Purple is for the word it's, the contraction for it is. Then we'll also need pink for the color too the number two, T-W-O. Anytime I see this word, I'm going to color it pink. Another one of our words is first. This word will be blue. More is the next snap word. We're gonna color more gray. Next up we have down, D-O-W-N. That word will be peach. The word now is red, than is green, and last, am, am, will be black. So for your sight word color today, I want you to go through and see if you can follow the color code. Anytime you see the word first, we're gonna color it blue. Anytime you see the word now, we'll color it red. Follow this sight word code to help you see the colored finished picture. After you finish um, this activity, you will wanna take a picture because this is your turn in assignment for today. So you'll take a picture of your completed coloring. Don't take a picture until everything is colored and you'll submit that on Canvas. Now let's do an example sentence together on the back because that's also part of your assignment for today. So each of these words are the words that were on our coloring on the front part of our color code. So now we need to practice using these sight words in a sentence. The first word we're gonna use is my. So let's think of a sentence using the word my. Hmm, I've got one. My dog is white. That's true. My dog's name is Murphy and he has white fur. Now you'll notice I underlined the word my because that is the sight word I'm using in the sentence. I started with an uppercase. I used a punctuation mark at the end. This is what your sentences should have too. Each sentence will have the sight word with the uppercase at the beginning and the punctuation mark at the end. The next word is first. I am in first grade. Can you use the word first in a sentence? Go ahead and write it here. The next word is now. Now. 
I will watch a movie now. Can you come up with a sentence using now? Now remember, I'm not gonna write all of these sentences, but we will think of sentences together that you could write on the line or you can come up with your own. This is your assignment. So your teachers wanna see how you use these words in a sentence all on your own too. Are you stretching out the sounds in each of the words you're writing? Are you using uppercase at the beginning and punctuation at the end? The next word is called. I called my mom on the phone. Called. Number five is the word more. I have more candy than ice cream. More is the word. The next word is than. I like the color red more than pink. Than. Here's that contraction. Oh, I'm going to add the apostrophe to show this word is it's for it is. It's Valentine's Day. Two is the next word. This is the number two. I'm going to write the number two to help me remember that this word is the number. I have two pickles. Next word is down. What sentence can you think of using the word down? I lay down in my bed. And the last word is am. I am six years old. Can you think of a sentence using the word am? Okay, first graders, we have gone through and heard each of the words that is on our sight word color for today. So once you have the coloring done, you're ready for your sentences using uppercase and punctuation marks and spaces between your words, of course. When you are finished with all of your sentences, take a picture so that you can show your teacher what sentences you wrote and all the great writing you did today. We can't wait to see your sight word color and also those great sentences that you came up with with those words that you know in a snap. Great job, first graders. Let's keep up the good work this afternoon on our e-learning Friday.